And welcome back. This is Brothers Good Boy with another episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy 2. I am joined, as always, by our trusty party of Luke, Nova, and Bro. We are joined by Mindy right now because we haven't been able to find Gray yet. There are a couple things that I forgot to do here in Altair, so let's go ahead and do those now. With Mindy in your party, if you talk to Hilda again, she will give you some new information to make up for them. The Imperials are now building the Dreadnought in Basque. So you have to memorize a Dreadnought. Ask her about it. The Dreadnought is a massive, heavily armed airship. What's an airship? We all know, but in case you're new to Final Fantasy, we don't really know what an airship is. What is that? A man named Sid once led Finn's Order of the White Knights. Yes, we are going to see the first introduction of Sid into Final Fantasy. And it's in the second game. He's not in the first game. It's kind of sad. But we got Sid now, and he builds airships in this game. He left Finn and sailed in Poft, where he now ferries travelers for a fee. Here, every gill he earns goes straight back into the airship to improve its performance. Awesome. So we do get two more, uh, two more pieces of information here, and that's kind of worth it. And that's pretty much it. That's, that's all we can do. Oh, no, 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 no. There is one other thing that we can do before I forget. We can talk to the king. Do you remember where the king was? He's over here. What is up, king? Scott has died, I see. He, ha he had asked for Hilda's hand in marriage, but he died before hearing the answer. He was most suited for my daughter. It is indeed regrettable. What do you know about Mithril? Much Mithril was mined and used in ancient times. The cavern behind the summit falls on the north was n a known mine. There are records of it. Sounds good. Sounds good. What well, you know about the Dreadnought? The Empire is building what? No one has informed me of any such thing. Didn't want to worry me, I suppose. Airship? Oh? <laughs> That's kind of awesome. There he is, Wild Rose. Yeah. It was Borgen that can betray us, Curses. So, that's pretty... That is all that we can do. So we need to head back out of Altair. But first I want to show you guys my little setup. Um, I haven't done any level grinding or anything like that, but I did go into the magic shop. And what did I get? Well, I, Luke, he's still using Cure. He's, he has, he's at 127 mastery on that. Uh, Nova did uh, get Ice and Cure. I got those for her. She should be close to, to loving up fire pretty close. Uh, bro, of course, doesn't have any, but look at Mindu. Oh my fucking god. He can use Cure, Life, Asuna, Basuna, Barrier, Blink, Shell, Shield, Wall, Dispel, Phase, Silence, Fog, Swap, Warp, and Fear. Yeah, you can warp out of a dungeon, but it reduces your NP or your HP. That's, that's stupid. Whatever. In terms of equipment, uh, Mindu actually had the copper plate, so I moved that over to Luke because he seems to be getting hit the most right now. Um, I don't know if that's uh, that's scripted into the game or not, but it seems to work. So everybody's pretty much on uh, leather. I did equip Mindu with a second staff uh, simply because, well, he, you know, I'm not really trying to level up Mindu. I'm trying to level up the rest of my party, so. What we're going to do now is we're going to leave Altair. Let's check our world map here. We are headed over here to the ferry. That is where we need to go. And first, we need to get into a battle right off the bat. I guess this will give us a chance to show off Mindu. Um, you know, we get a preemptive strike, so everybody... You know, you, you still use... Let's use ice, because nobody's seen ice. You can attack him. Um, he's pure white magic, so... We can just attack the other guy over here. And then he attacks with the left hand. Does five damage. Not enough for the win. That's alright. Get to show off ice for once. Does 18 damage. What does bro do? Two hits? Two hits. That's plenty of damage. That's why he is our tank. He can just regular attack. And everybody gets a little experience, but nobody levels up at all. Okay, so what we want to do, yeah, you can use the canoe, boom, just right over, right across. That's what we look like in the canoe. Once again, we're the little, the little, the little gray man inside 
a canoe. How all four of us fit in there, I'll never know. Uh, so we easily make it over to this town over here. This is the town of Palum. Oh, do we have pirates already? Uh, we are looking for that, but not not yet. You know, so I talk to him, 32 gil. Later, you're over in Poft. The Empire hasn't attacked Palum or Poft yet. Ugh. If you take a boat from here, you'll reach Poft. Everybody wants to talk about the boat. What's up, dude? Hey, Sugar, why don't you join me for a drink? <laughs> he said while looking at Luke and not Nova. Well, he was looking at Nova. Oh. Ew, get away from me! Nova is not one for pirates. Here, Basque and Sutherland have been taken by the Empire. Do we have any new weapons here? What have we got? Got a dagger, mace, axe, and bow. So, dagger and mace are new. I don't really want to buy those, and I don't have the money for it anyways. There are, I believe, eight kinds of weapons in this game. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, all on the right. What well, well including the shield. Um, you have the unarmed, you have yeah, it's kind of crazy how many weapons you can use in this game. This is Paloom, a little poor town, as you can see. I did indeed. Uh, I think that's actually out of town. I mean this is a this is a very small town. Most of them are gonna be pretty small. Paloom is a town of freedom. Why don't you live with me, handsome? Okay. Okay, we're, we're not going to respond to that, apparently. Uh, we do have bronze equipment here for everybody. I would love to buy those, but I just can't afford it right now. That's okay. That's okay. In terms of magic, what do we have? Um, I still don't have bolt for anybody. Um, they do have cure. I do have three people in my party that know cure now. Blink, shield, and shell. Nobody knows those except for Mindy. It's awesome. And that's pretty much it for town, you know? That That's it. Now what we want to do... Is, um... We want to just head over to Poft, I think. I don't think there's anything to do. Yep. Yep, that's it. I know, I, I was considering leveling up, but I've decided against it. Um... For now. We might level up later on. Yeah, I can't control this. It's just, an, it's literally a ferry. It just takes you over to the next town, so. Maybe there'll be some uh, stronger enemies there. We can level up a little better. What's this up here? I, I've never, I've never really known. So now we are in the town of Poft. So sweet, we're just moving right along to the north is Salamant and to the east is Bafsk. Uh, no. Not right now. Oh, they have a pub here, so Poft is already a hundred times better than Paloom. The town of Basque is to the east, but it's been occupied by the army. They're building something horribly big there. That's what the other guy said. I, are you guys all going to say the same thing? Are you serious? Okay, whatever. Hey, you look different. Sid? What? Hey, you wanna ride my airship? Memorize... Yeah, ask about the airship. Give your gill to the guy behind me. He's... he... I don't handle money. This guy handles the money. You wanna ride the only airship in the world? We'll take you anywhere in a flash, you know. Uh, not right now. Not right now. Uh, they all say the same thing, except for that one guy. That's... Oh, even the guy behind the counter says the same thing. Yeah, they didn't really put that much effort into NPCs in this game. Not even gonna lie. We have the inn up here. And that's apparently out of town. I didn't want to leave town yet. I've always, like, look, okay, this town on the outside, right, is all walls. But when you get inside down, there's, like, no walls whatsoever. I've never understood that. But it happens in a lot of cities here. Have you seen the airship that belongs to Sid? He's the only one that can control that thing. We have the item shop here. I believe it's always going to be the same items no matter where you go. Uh, there's the weapon shop here. Do you guys have anything better than the last place? Nope. Same weapons as Paloom. And I'm going to say that's out of town again. 
And what about magic? Do we have different magic here? You guys better. No, same as Plume. So apparently they have traded everything back and forth, so they don't have anything unique anymore. That's kind of lame. What's up, dude? Oh my god, are you guys all going to say that? Oh. Yeah, I already found Sid. I already know. Do you guys have anything new here? No, it's the same, the same stuff. Okay, hold on for one second. Okay, what we want to do is indeed talk to Sid now. Now that we've made it here, we need to procure more travel. So what we want to do is talk to this guy over here. Right. Yes, we require money. Uh, you can go to Bafsk if you want. If you've got enough money, uh, you can uh, buy a Suna there. It's kind of, you know, expensive though. Uh, you can also go to Salaman, Summit Falls, and Cassian. We want to go to Salaman, but as you can see, we don't have enough money. So I am going to have to go out and level grind for it. Well, you know, grind for it. So I will do that off screen and I will be right back. While leveling, I found this guy. He is a loper. Um, I don't know how strong he is, and he looks retarded, so I'm just going to try to beat the crap out of him. Ah, he went down with one hit. Awesome. Now, even though nobody else got a turn, it counts as experience towards that. Um, yeah, I, I, I didn't even make it out of town before I fought that. So... Even though it might only take one turn, you want to do the thing that you're trying to level up anyways because it still counts. Okay, I'm going to continue leveling up, and if uh, we find somebody new, I'll show that off. Otherwise, I'll meet you back in town when I have enough money. And we do find some more new enemies here. These are Bloodsuckers. They are red, so I assume they are weak to ice. So let's go ahead and do that. Or they're, they're weak to sword, too. Oh, I bet they're weak to that. Good lord, that's a lot of damage that bro is doing. So yeah, bloodsuckers. Oh, sweet, we finally found treasure. This is the treasure getting screen. So yes, we found eye drops. And no, nothing stacks in this game. So yeah, you see all those potions, how they're on separate lines? Yeah. And now we have a limit to our inventory. Yeah, it's not, it's not fun. So, awesome. Be right back once again. And we've encountered our third new enemy here. This, These are Goblin Guards. Now, fire has leveled up. It's now fire level 2, and it, does, uh, it takes 2 MP, so we'll see how much damage that does. Still don't care about Mindu, but good lord, look at his HP. He is so overpowered compared to the rest of us. But luckily, we can take down these enemies no problem. Oh, don't don't you dare finish them off. Damn it. I wanted to show off fire too. But those are goblin guards. They go down pretty easy. They give us quite a bit of gil though. I'll meet you on the other side once again. And we have yet another new enemy. Good lord, this place is just full of them. This is a soldier. Um, the, the fire animation is the same. So I'm really working on the ice magic right now. It does arrows one for 13 damage. This guy is not going to be a pushover for us. One hit, come on, is that enough? No, we need the power of the magic. 16 more damage is enough for the win. So yeah, it, this guy is gonna probably be your toughest fight around here because bro got hit again. He gets another uh, level up to his HP. I'm gonna be healing him off screen once again. Still grinding, be right back. And we have yet another new enemy! Good lord, this place is loaded with them. We have a queen bee here. And I am going to be uh, taking her out as soon as I can. Mindu has become quite the little attacker here since I've, uh, since I've leveled up his staff quite a bit. Yeah, a lot of stuff runs for me. And, of course, Bro gets poisoned. But it shouldn't take too long. Oh, look at that fire. Fire took out almost everybody. So the queen bee never gets to attack. Uh, 66 kill, that's not bad. Nova's magic increases yet again. So once again, uh, still grinding. Still grinding. 
And oh wow, those battles went on a lot longer than I thought they would. I'm all done grinding, uh, so we will figure out what we're supposed to do next time, where we're supposed to go. I believe it's supposed to be Salamander, so we will be heading there next time. I hope you guys have enjoyed this part. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.